the search for our first home win of the league season it goes on another week Alan Claybank 1-0 victors this afternoon your thoughts on this afternoon's performance uh, first half we pretty much controlled the game obviously the win conditions uh, we had a strong win behind us in the first half and we, we played a lot of football uh, but without really creating too many chances uh, we've hit the bar there's another couple of efforts uh, we just couldn't get the ball over the line in the first half I uh, They've obviously come out in the second half with a strong win behind them. And um, again, disappointing goal. The boys took a touch in the box and he said time to uh, put it away. Wasn't a great deal between the teams. Uh, it was an evenly balanced game and fine margins. They've, they've got the goal there and we got the road with three points and they're still sitting waiting for a home win. So. You mentioned that win there, obviously you had it in the first half, second half you'd be playing against it. Did that alter the way that you were going to come out that second half and try to you know, break that deadlock? I, well, to be honest, it's, sometimes it's easier uh, playing against the wind. I, the ball's not running through at times, so we like to get the ball and, and play it into the, the, the strikers' the feet and then play off that, play off second balls. But we just couldn't get high enough up the park. They had us crammed in uh, for much of the second half. It's fine margins again, a 1-0 defeat this afternoon, you know, it was 2-1 against Darvel, 2-1 against Caddox, it's narrow defeats, do you take any positives from these these, these narrow defeats to take into next week against Bede? Oh, look, we're, no, we're no a million miles away, but uh, positive today, there's, there's uh, Chris come in, he's not played in the, the league all season and I thought he had a great save in the first half and he, he's done fairly well, so that's a positive for that point of view. I, obviously, Brian Boylan's just back, so there's another positive. But we've well, had a few words in the dressing room, and uh, the players know we need more at them. We need more at them. That's, that's the bottom line. Yep. And then just a few wee injury updates, obviously, from midweek there. Obviously, Aidan back at the club today, and Kieran here on stretchers. Is there any update you can give to the fans on their condition? I, Kieran went for his MRI on Friday, so he's waiting on the results. That should be early next week. Uh, young Aidan was in seeing the doctor at Kilmarnock on Friday, they phoned me this morning. They'll have another doctor looking at him on Monday and then it's up to them in terms of whether they can go and train or not. Obviously the, the concussion rule is it, it should be a week to ten days. So uh, it depends how he gets on the Monday and we'll, we'll see whether he's in at training next week or not.